inside the bag, we are told investigators came up with notes and references to the New World Order, which is kind of a growing conspiracy group that believes the world is going to be taken over by forces and black helicopters and so on. Airship that will be used as a new cruise missile defense system. Privacy advocates are leery over the system's ability to monitor moving objects. This year you'll see a nativity scene at the state capitol in Lansing. And because of that, you'll also see something very different. The satanic temple is being allowed to create its own holiday display this year. And as Fox News Dave Spencer shows us, not everyone is happy that the devil is getting equal time. The affirmative task we have now is, uh, is to actually um, uh, create uh, uh, a new world order. Be Lead to a standstill. These images show people with their arms raised pressed against the large glass windows. A black Islamic flag was unraveled and held up against the glass by people inside. As police surrounded the area, the gunman was seen pacing into in the country.
every form cries for mercy from it, in man for freedom from it. Yet none can resist its irresistible pull to live, and to live again. Here is the mystery of life and existence. Please close your eyes again. Enter the stillness, the eternal void. If you can find enough love or awareness in yourself, you will stay conscious and realize as you go deeper, that you have been here many times before. But if your love is not yet sufficient to keep you awake, you will go unconscious. And when the journey through death is concluded, you will awake in a world equivalent to the love and consciousness you are. You will be more at home than ever before in your life. Either way you go, conscious or unconscious, you still arrive at journey's end. You will then realize that love is the most important thing in life. And that the world of the living exists purely for the demonstration of more love. You will see how far it is from love. And you will want to tell the whole world what you have discovered. But that won't be possible. Because you have to discover that and declare it and live it. Everyone must discover the secret of love for themselves. If not before they die, then after. No one can be told. This is the never-never world of living on borrowed time. It's blatant disregard for the justice of who really owes who, and who really owes what, creates the vicious injustice or imbalance that never stops growing between the poor and the rich, the handicapped and the strong, the starving and the sleep, the deprived and the privileged. So appallingly ill-balanced has it all become that only the end of time itself, which is now approaching, can settle the account.
We are here for life. We are here to be cosmically intelligent. When enough of us are cosmically intelligent, we will open the earth to cosmic life and participate in that inconceivable reality.